Okay, hello everybody and welcome to a very, very long stream because I am gonna be attempting to finish the game and I know that that's gonna take me more than two hours probably closer to four So, where we are right now is we're gonna be heading towards the Giovanni Mansion Now, if I was speedrunning this, it would probably take a lot less <laughs> <laughs> than four hours, but alas, I am not. I think my record for playing through this game unmodded was like four or five hours. I don't know how I managed to do that. When I tried to replicate that on somebody else's stream channel later on, that was like 13 yes, hours. what is it? I just know that the ending missions take me longer than I ever anticipate, so I am anticipating the length this time. There is a party here tonight. I'm afraid it's invitation only. Uh, how did you get in here? Do you have an invitation? Of course. Who are you? Give me your invitation. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna tell him to give me his invitation. Unless, of course, I can raise my persuasion. What is my persuasion at? I'm surprised, that's pretty high. No, it's not worth it. Yeah, what is it? Is a party here tonight? Ah, uh, yes. Oh, yes. Caviar and champagne, darling. You know how these things are. Got my invitation right, right here, love. You have an invitation. Did I just say I have an invitation? If I did, yeah, I have an invitation. Yes, what is it? Is your wife okay? She'll be fine after I get a pot of coffee in her. If I were you, I would worry about her embarrassing me. Well, she did pretty much cause the last function to come to a screeching halt. That woman has the self-control of a pubescent chimpanzee. You better hurry up. I think she's gonna puke. Come on, Maria. We're going home. I think she's mortal. Her puking wine is not great. I'm gonna take both, even though it's fairly clear that I can't use his invitation. Ah, <laughs> uh, that would be kind of funny, though. There we go. So I, I didn't mess it up. I had enough points. <laughs> I had enough points to get in here. You have invitation. Here you go. Mm. Please have a wonderful time. Thank you. How nice of you, my man. Wishing me to have a wonderful time. Oh, that's where the doors are. I was like, the doors are missing. Don't you hate it when your doors go missing? I wanna just double check things for stuff. Oh shit. What am I, what would I even be breaking into? <laughs> Kinda looks like a toilet, honestly. Must be one heck of an important toilet. Lock it that tightly. Maybe Giovanni is really into locking their toilets very tightly. Okay, that's the kitchen. Oh. He looks fancy. Don't remember him around either. Sorry, you can't come in here right now. Sorry, you can't come in. There's a meeting in progress. If you have business with Bruno, it'll have to wait. Oh, Bruno's meeting? Where does this lead? That's the kitchen. 
Okay, don't bloody blood buff yourself unless you want the whole party to attack you. My dude, I didn't do anything that awful. It's a simple blood buff, okay? So this is the pool. Well, I mean, doi. Everything's locked real tight around here. Maybe that's where the bathroom led. In here. I mean, into the meeting. I wonder what do you get for entering the meeting? Um, whoops, I didn't mean to, like, um, pick a lock in front of you. I... I also didn't think that you would shoot me for that. Okay, I'll go the way I came here. No need to be so rude. Then I'll try this direction too. Anyone left any easy to access items around? Preferably not like locked behind the door that I can't open. No, I guess not. I hope I have enough perception to see the last item that Tisha needs. So that's where they're having the meeting. Hi. I don't think we've met before. Maria Rosalini, and you are? Nadia Milliner. It's a pleasure to meet you, Maria. Are you from the Chicago Rosalinis? Yeah, that's right. Oh, you must give my regards to Great Aunt Frances when you get back. I stayed with her last time I was out that way. She was very sweet to me. I will. So what do you do? I'm working on my master's out here. I'm from back east. The Giovannis have been nice enough to let me stay here while I finish up my studies. I've learned a great deal from them, like you wouldn't believe. For example? I, um, I really can't say much about that. <laughs> oh, come on, you can tell me. We're all family, aren't we? Oh, forget about it, really. It's nothing. You know, you want to tell me. Okay, I'll show you something, but you can't tell anyone. Promise? Follow me. I'll follow you soon. I have some people to swindle. Might as well be a costume party. Everyone's smiling, pretending this isn't a pageant put on by the patriarch of this family. Fine. But this is a contest, and I came to win. What are you talking about? If you don't even know about the contest, then you really don't have to worry about winning it. Hey there, Adam Dunsern. I don't think we've met. You are? Maria, pleasure to meet you. What line of work are you in? <laughs> oh god, the last one. I'm an import-exporter. Myself, I'm an investment banker. Great business, lot of potential. For example, I got the inside track on this company right now. And let me tell you, when this company goes public, everyone's going to wish they had a piece of it. Then why don't you invest in it? Well, I know somebody at the company, and that's what they call insider trading. I could lose my job for that. I'm not interested. You sure? Well, let me know if you change your mind. Trust me, you really want to be a part of this. Think about what? it. What? Oh, uh, sure. Nothing to be concerned about. Excuse me. Okay, I am very bad at getting a quest from them oh. to expose each Hello, other's Anne. secrets. I forgot to introduce myself. Hmm. Mira. Mira Giovanni. So what exactly did you mean when you called this a contest? They gather us up here to decide just who's the best and brightest of this generation is. The lucky few are given the real power in this family. But some of us need to win more than others. Oh, forget it. You wouldn't understand. 
Do you need help winning it? Actually, I'll spare no expense for a lock. I want to be in that circle of power, and I won't let blood get in the way. And of course, when your time comes, I'll pay back the favor. I see what I can dig up. Given that opportunity some thought? Well, it's a biotech firm. You know they're working on growing replacement organs. Really fascinating technology. In a couple of years, I'd bet everyone will be going to them for parts. I figure an investment of $50,000 could be easily tripled in five years. Um, how much did your last investments return? You take risks in this game. Sometimes you make a million, sometimes you lose a million. Mm -hmm. The economy changes. It's had problems lately, but it's bound to rock it back any week now. Oh, it's about to crash real hard, honey. Um, you don't sound very confident. I won't lie to you. I've had a couple of busts here and there. Had a few losses, it happens. But this company, this is the big score right here. Anything you wanted to invest, 50, 30, 15 grand, whatever. It's high yield, low risk. So, essentially, you haven't made any money in a while. Well, the business, it's... You'll understand if I have to pass on your offer. Okay, alright. You change your mind, you let me know. <sighs> Nothing to be concerned about. Excuse me. What? Oh, uh, sure. It's a nice place to have here. You know Uncle Bruno. Seen any good movies lately? I'm sorry, I've got a lot on my mind lately. If you'll excuse me. Sarcophagus? What sarcophagus? Out this room, second room on your left. Oh, hello again. Yes? Given that opportunity, some thought? Sarcophagus? Well... You take risks. I won't lie to you. Okay, I can't make him admit that Come he's on. broke or get anything out of that guy. I'm just Come gonna on. say that my persuasion is probably not high enough, so I'm gonna leave it alone. Because otherwise, I could have gotten a bit more XP there, but it costs XP to gain XP, and I don't wanna spend money right now. But I'll spend XP. Come on. Okay, now it's gonna be the moment of truth. Which is... Can I see the item that Pisha needs? Yes! I can! That's good. You know what they do in this room? Looks like an embalming room in a funeral apparel. Mm-hmm. You know what they do with the corpses? Dress them up like Vikings, freeze them in ice, and drop them in the ocean? Uh, I shouldn't do this, but why don't I show you? It gets pretty weird from here. My character don't has quite the imagination. Me. Oh, and be ready to run. You'll understand when it happens. Follow me. Shh. They don't usually attack. Just don't provoke them. That's not a lot of blood. I'm gonna run on a 
ever reducing blood supply through here because I have no humans to eat. The only good thing about this place is that this isn't the anti tribute mod, which puts OP skeleton guards that throw projectiles here. <laughs> it's just your regular everyday Zimbambos. Can still be dangerous, sort of. Especially if one of them does this. There's literally no no um guarantee that you can survive when that happens. I vaguely remember items in one of these, but... Doesn't super matter. Just don't ever let the charging ones get close. Unless, of course, you really have a death wish. It hit really hard. Oh, I smell super. They don't hit very hard. Definitely no item in here. Well, the game's finally allowing me to go. Great. I get to go now. Okay, you immediately starts with battle music. That's not very promising. <laughs> Okay, half of this gauntlet, you can just run. to those through those doors you actually do have to fight
Okay, now I can't take another hit. But it's not aggravated damage, so it should come back over time just fine. Aggravated damage is a bit horrible. That's the one that goes with the yellow line, because those feel extra slowly. Okay, in her. One of these doors actually do open. I do remember that. There we go. This is another inner place. You know, we have an innie and an outie. So, this is an innie. You don't need to fight them. In the anti-tribute mod, there is like an actual boss there. You do need to fight that. Nine points, um, which means I'm not going to drink right now. Would be a bad idea. Let's try this one. This might give them a health hit. We'll see. Kindred, your presence here violates the agreement between our leaders. Leave now or face the consequences of your actions. Let's discuss this problem, whatever it may be. There is an alliance between your leader, LaCroix, and Mistress Ming Zhao. You violate the agreement. If you do not leave, we are not responsible for your death. Don't worry, you won't be responsible. I'll tell them. Let me just throw in a save. Let them pile through here. I hope I have my sword equipped. Oh, I did not. This is a bit hard to control! Three! Sword! Come here! Now it's time to drinky! Oh, damn it! I'm playing a bit of a low health, which is not ideal. And I am trying to scroll through my abilities, which is not ideal.
let me just throw in a save here. This one will recharge slowly. You can just dock them backwards while things are recharging. Oh shit. Sometimes they will run around each other, which is not ideal. Especially considering that I'm trying to handle menus at the same time. <laughs> Let's try and throw in a save here. Halfway through their health bar. That like math. That was a very bad math move on me, on my part. May as well have thrown that one. You want to hit them no matter what. I can throw in the save here. I still have several blood packs. We are getting closer. This is a pretty nasty fight. Run another save here. I am getting very close to just outright killing them. when my phone vibrates for no reason. Like, what do you want, Dylan? Ah, you see, I'm busy. Please. Spy agent, spy on me. See that I'm busy. One of them just died. Ugh. 
No! Hmm. Why do I keep on trying to hit myself in the head? Let me just save because one of them is dead now. Both of them are dead now. Okay. Whoa! I killed the Changs! Nobody at the party was the wiser, apparently. It is quite pricey to use blood packs, but um, I want to not die from thirst while speaking to Lacroix, and because your health ticks my wunderkind returns down. In my entire court, I knew there was only one who could have succeeded in this task. Finally, the Ancoran sarcophagus is ours. Yay Come. for us! I've granted Beckett's request to study and document all the markings of the sarcophagus. You've met Beckett, haven't you? Let's go take a look inside, and see what the commotion around the city has really been all about. Are you in an alliance with Kui Jin? What? Preposterous! No kindred would trust them, nor would they trust us. Did Jack tell you that? Because it sounds like you've been taken for a fool. I was told by the Kui Jin agents sent to steal the sarcophagus. And you believed them? They've been trying to take over L.A. for years. It's a rumor, More than that, a really. falsehood, spread to undermine my rule and turn kindred against each other, thin our ranks. They are duplicitous, evil I'm creatures. pretty sure Ming Zhao implied it, too. they not to kill you? Yeah, but... Insurance. They lied to you in case you lived through the encounter. They hoped to create dissension in the ranks, rumors. It's a trick older than you or I. Uh, um, let's open the sarcophagus. Which we obviously can't do. What have you assessed so far? Unfortunately for the Heralds of Doom, it appears we won't be opening Pandora's box. The markings, as far as I can tell, are of Assyrian origin. An extraordinary piece, but nothing earth-shattering. I see. Then there is no good reason why we shouldn't open it. <clears throat> How about we don't have the key? <clears throat> Budge. Beckett, do you see any mechanism for the lid? I haven't as yet had a chance to pour over it with my fine tooth comb. I think I have one in my bag. <clears throat> why won't it? Why won't it open, Beckett? And you? I thought you said it looked as if it had been opened on the Dane. I want it open! You! You and Beckett, figure out a way to open it. I need to know what's inside. I have other matters to attend to. Come get me when a solution has been found. Ah, uh, that nice hole right there! Ah, the depths to which I'll sink to prove others wrong. The young ones get so temperamental. Fortunately for Okay, Sebastian, did you vibrate for any good reason? I'd already made up my mind to open the sarcophagus. If only to show the city that Gehenna, contrary to popular belief... Has not begun. No, for some reason there. Um, my phone just decided to show me like. UK politics news. Which, yeah, sure. I'm in UK, but like. Oh, that's why I forgot my mobile internet on on. That's not good. 
Let me just switch that off. Don't want to use the data. I don't have like unlimited data on my phone. So um, definitely don't want to be paying for that. What do you think's inside? Put your ear to it. I'll shake it and you tell me what you think's inside. All right, dumb question. How do we open it? Hmm. Fortunately for us, I know of someone who has distinguished himself in this field. Ooh. His name is Dr. Ingvar Johansson, a professor of archaeology from Norway. He was the one responsible for finding the sarcophagus, and as far as I know, the only authority on its origin and design. Where can I find him? Until yesterday, he could have been found in his suite at the Empire Hotel downtown. But when I stopped by earlier this evening, all I found was spilt coffee on a morning paper. Appears he's been abducted. <laughs> Tommy has left some notes or a diagram or something. I did find a pair of bikini swimwear and a book detailing the origins of various Turkish dialects. That's all? I detected the scent of myrrh incense, which is usually burned in monasteries. I don't even know what also, myrrh incense smells like. I found beach like. sand in part of a muddy footprint. I can Putting probably two two together, detect Yankee candles by now. I beach in Malibu, where I believe hunters are holding Johansson captive. So I detected a scent of um, a hint of... Um, Island Paradise. <laughs> it is my belief that whoever was there was into some pretty good aromatherapy. <laughs> you figured all that out from sniffing around this room? Actually, there were two hunters on the roof of the building opposite the hotel who were positively delighted to tell me everything they knew. Provided I stop dangling them head first over the side. Hunters have that guy? Why would, a, why would hunters want an archaeologist? The hunters abducted Dr. Johansson for his own protection. Or at least that's how they've justified it. He's being held by the Society of Leopold and used quite ingeniously as bait for Prince LaCroix's minions. Good luck getting him out. It's not that I don't love walking into the heart of danger to curry favor with well, the local magistrate I don't of the either. Hour. But actually, that's exactly it. I'd rather not get involved in the politics of it. Besides, I'd better document the sarcophagus before Sebastian's goon smashes it open. Fine, what do I do? You'll have to go to the monastery and find a way into the tunnels beneath where the hunters are holding you your hands. You eat my way through. I'm afraid I can't accompany you. But then it's best you go alone. Too many of us might set them off. Like fundamentalists on contrary opinion. But it sounds so much fun. I'll kill every hunter in the place if I have to. I'd recommend no other course of action to the foolhardy. I wouldn't recommend walking. Certainly, Sebastian's already provided cab fare. I'm sure he always spares no expense when archaeology is at stake. I have a couple questions first. Excellent. Have you learned anything else about Thin Bloods? How any sane kindred could think these poor unfortunates are an immediate threat to us is absurd. Most were afraid, or at the very least uneasy, around me. Tragic. Their desperation could very well hold the spark of revolution, however. Anything else you could tell me about the Society of Leopold? The Society, for the most part, knows very little about us. But they do know how to kill and torture us, and that's enough. Also, some of them exhibit powers that can make them quite formidable. Obfuscate will serve you well around the hunters. I am bringing it, so... 
You spoke of Gehenna before. Think the sarcophagus is part of it? Well, if we open it up and the world ends, then yes. If we open it up and the world does not end, then no. I'd wager the latter. Tell me about yourself. Hmm. I've said quite a lot about myself already. I know even less about you than you do me. Why don't you tell me about yourself? You know what? I'm gonna try the second line just because I normally do not. Uh, this beast, I can't help but get into it. It's so tempting. I've seen some of the most docile, respected colleagues become emotionless killers within a few decades. It's tempting to give in, to resist struggling. It's easy to remember you're a walking corpse. Try to forget. Well, I appreciate the advice. Unless you've got further questions, I'd really like to get back to <laughs> the wee humanity. <laughs> Remember, Dr. Johansson is an innocent. He has no idea we actually exist. Try not to put the idea in his head. Okay. I, first of all, could really use some food <laughs> of any kind. They're not like the real me. The real me is quite well fed, thank you. Um, my husband made kidneys and liver today. And we also have a heart in the fridge. Not a human heart, mind you. No, we're the kidneys and liver human. Uh, you're not... We're definitely not slaughtering anyone in here. Um, that would be very insidious of me. It would also be pretty dumb to just proclaim committing acts of crime on... I wanted to say TV, but this is not TV. I would like to get some money. Oh, cool. 28. Perfect. Okay, so that... Thing does not does not enter my scroll bar either, so I'm just gonna hide it here. This would be a great place to lure somebody. Um, would anyone see me from here? <sighs> that guy nearly did, but um, then he stopped. Okay. Then he ran. Um, he was simply too close. Can't... Can't drink her from such a distance. Wouldn't work very well. Watch that way. Where do you go? Okay. You two just stand there and talk. Uh, 
Okay, they, they still see me from over there, unfortunately. People around here really sure do love walking. Criminal violation, but not masquerade violation. Yeah, I can take a criminal violation, it's fine. It is not fine if I get shot at, but I am currently not getting shot at. Yeah, why not? I'll go in. I can feed for the rest. Some people inside the label to say. Money, right? Been a while. Your money's been piling up. Here, that should provide for an interesting evening. Thank you. I'm mostly just trying to pile that money. I don't want to use it up until the last few missions, and even then, I want to sneak past as much things as possible. It is not absolutely necessary that I sell up right now, but... I may as well. Eight hundred is not ideal. It's better than zero, but it's still not ideal. I might need to choose between the flame launcher and stacking up on blood. her thing. I'll see, maybe I'll improve my finances skill. That should at least help with the prices. Hello. Yes. Here's the book. The Giovanni never willingly share their secrets, <laughs> and I've had little success infiltrating their strongholds. How did you obtain this? Well, of course I didn't take it willingly, you silly goose. They were a little distracted. It will take some time to translate and unlock the secrets of this. I will have to move on from the city to evade any Giovanni seeking it. Take this. This will complete the terms we agreed to, and I think it is adequate compensation. What if I don't? It is don't? the key of Alamut. It instills dread in those that would harm you, and makes it harder for them to strike you. Make no mistake, our dealings do not make us allies. If indeed we meet again, do not ask me for any favors. I will give you this final advice, however. Leave this city. These are its final nights. Discord looms heavy. I've felt this before. What do you mean? In November of 1938, I was translating documents in Leipzig, Germany, written by a purported Crusades-era necromancer. There also, I felt a sense of impending chaos. Soon after was the Kristallnacht, the wellspring of a new world war. Hi, if Third World War ever starts in LA, I'll, I'll remember your words. And that you sensed it many, many decades in advance. Actually, 
actually, if we like finish this whole sarcophagi running around, does that um? I hate how that outfit looks. Does that mean that the Going feeling somewhere. of doom suddenly goes away for everybody? Let's just go to Society of Leopold. We have nothing else to do that I know about. I now have five skill points. My barter is at way too low, it's at four. I don't really appreciate that. Having low barter skill, that is. It is nice how this mod made it actually, you know, useful. Oh, yes! I am going in the right direction, good. I was really questioning myself for a second. One of them is there. Both of them are here. Greetings, Commander. Greetings, soldier. Anything to report? The Gladius Day has told us to keep a sharp eye. He thinks we may have some visitors this evening. Of course, sir. My duty, as always, is to protect the Brotherhood. All seems quiet for now. Good, good. Did he mention... Uh, what kind of visitor, sir? The only kind that matters, soldier. Yes, sir. Of course, sir. Carry on. Let's, let's not trigger. <laughs> How was I not noticed for so long the last time? Never mind. We'll feed somewhere else. Oh shit. <laughs> I forgot that I'm not invisible. Oh, that's a doozy. Might be able to eat this guy. I just want to eat one dude from the outside, that's all. I don't need any more than that. Just to refill my blood supply. If I remember, you can actually use the front entrance with no fear. Because once you cross over, you have some time to reactivate invisibility. Okay, okay maybe not game. Maybe not this time, just on the regular and normally. Right? This time it was just a strong no, according to the game. That is a lot of dudes. Lord, I pray now that you that I might overcome the hordes of Satan and his children. That I might wield the flaming sword of the Archangel and defend myself with your shield of faith. And that my victories are many in my world. That I might further your kingdom here on earth. And if I meet death tonight... 
And if I may death tonight, may my death be glorious. Then let it be first that I cast a mighty host of demons. Who's there? Oh, buddy. <laughs> you guys just gonna continue to pile on in here, or...? I gotta say, sniper rifles are pretty cool. So is everything else that I have. Maybe I don't need that many crossbows. That is their armor is flying it is armed to hell and back. Brother Grunfeld seems particularly uneasy this evening. Yes, LaCroix has begun to move more openly. And Brother Grunfeld grows impatient. Ah yes, LaCroix. As always, Brother Grunfeld mm. focuses only mm. on his old nemesis. Mm. Hey ho! That was invisible, man! I'll take this guy. Sniper rifle, thank you. I'm like, we'll wait for her to come back. She can be my snake. She gets all the way over here after all. Nobody else does. That guy in particular removes invisibility from anyone that gets too close. I'm gonna throw in a save. I think I can drink up this guy. One dude patrolling all the way over there. This break in is gonna be harder than I want it to be. It's maybe not be seen. <sighs> there we go. As long as she's silent, you can eat her very silently. It's good. Oh, 
Can't let that guy see me. Or else consequences. <sighs> now quite a few of these things do not work on anyone that's like blessed by the blessing of being human and having a god. There we go. So, we'll see. Hmm. Oh, that one works very well, at least. <laughs> at least for a while. And I can't trigger that explosion myself. Shit. That was nearly correct. Don't want to trigger the last guy over there. Hey, <laughs> yep, those abilities do not work on them. Good to know. <laughs> Let's not bounce into the other explosive, maybe. to give you like an extra health bar so it's not be a very big one let me just throw in a save here because he has already sustained a lot of damage and yet he still has so much health the hell, dude? There we go. Oh yes, the invisible flaming man, that makes perfect sense. You definitely can't see me. Don't know why you ever think that you can. <laughs> this is totally not sus at all. <sighs> Just save. At least I'm no longer on fire. Rest, rest. 
Swear the boxes in here were sounding like people. Let's just go upstairs, see if we can grab some keys, then continue on our way. One of us should take some food down to the prison. Johansson? He is no better than they. If not for his medicine diggings, the artifact would never have come. <laughs> this Okay, let's not get shot in the face while taking the keys. And that's not much intellect. One of us should take some food down to the prison. Johansson? He is no better than they. If not for his meddlesome diggings, the artifact would <laughs> Yeah, maybe I shouldn't like collide with people, like I, I don't know, if you're like sneaking around invisible, that's just, that sounds like a bit of a bad idea, but, you know, that's just me. One of us should take some food down to the prison. Johansson? He is no better than they. If not for his meddlesome diggings, the artifact would never have come here. Yes, it is complicated matters. An interesting Do you think it holds something? I guess. If it does, then with God's help, we will send it straight back to hell. What brother the son of Adam, the brother can Don't know what you think you saw, but it's definitely nothing. Don't need to worry about that. Shall we take some food down to your hands? Yes, take mine. I'm no longer hungry. Power sock off. They're not very secure with their passwords, are they? Did you leave just this one dude in here? I think the answer is no. There's probably someone else around, but still not a lot of dudes. <sighs> hey, there's that dude too. I hate those dudes. Oh, the passion. My trip doesn't need to be two ways, so I don't need to kill absolutely everyone around, but... If he has the anti-invisibility field... Curse you and your... holy blood. In general, having an anti-invisibility bro with a shotgun is not too great. Everything's lovely, go back home. Ah, I don't need to handle anti-invisibility, dude, after all. I can just proceed through here, which I much prefer.
Now, without the mod, anti-invisibility bros are practically meaningless. So... They're mostly here for difficulty, I think. Not gonna lie. If that was the un last anti-invisibility bro, I don't mind. This guy is very confused. It's like, where did my friend go? He literally fell through the through the scenery, and it's like, yep, that that's just what happens when you die. You disintegrate. What, you never died before? Now, what is the strength on the lock on Ash's cage? I'm gonna guess 10. Just because, you know, 10 is hard to get. So they probably put in 10. And these dudes can't sense for shit, so it's fine. No idea that I'm here. Let's keep it that way. Yes, I suppose. Ooh, bombs. Well, I don't know the man who can hold his breath for that long. Lovely. Hmm, it is ten. Still at five here. Get broken then unbroke. That's not. Hey, stop right there. Not great. Okay. This is dumb. Okay, he's def he was definitely aware, but he's going places now. <laughs> oh, he shot his buddy. Isn't that sad, eh? Isn't it just so sad that you shot your buddy? Wow. <sighs> Now, I do have quite a bit of books here. The origin of this dark and mysterious talisman is largely unknown and is mostly considered a myth, if not for the etchings of Julius of Ghoul, who first discovered and then subsequently re-entombed the artifact. There would be almost no historical record of the artifact, save for various unfounded legends. Of its evilness scattered throughout the writings of the Brotherhood, historians and theologians alike have been unable to ascertain its exact age or place of origin. Although the symbols and inscriptions seem to hint that the artifact is from the area of ancient Sumer or Mesopotamia, it has never been opened, and therefore any myths pertaining to who might be encased in the to is total speculation. Vampiric origins have not been ruled out, although many scholars within the church seem to think that it holds the remains of an ancient king whose name so far has been lost to the ages. Let it be said, though, that the writings of Julius Gould describe the artifact as being a nefarious and dread thing full of some ancient and undeniable evil. He attributes the death of his scribe to the artifact, who, upon setting his eyes on it for the first time, began convulsing uncontrollably and promptly died. 
Um, there you go, background. You can hold my stuff. I don't like having this much stuff on me. It, it makes it pretty confusing to move around. Um, I definitely don't need all of this. This is all for the ground's sake now. Um, the ground can have it. This journal is inscribed with the initials GB. We have tracked LaCroix to Los Angeles. He made his lair in the penthouse of the Venture Tower. Venture Tower. Oh, wow. That's very close to Venture. Hiding behind some legitimate business front while commanding his legion of demons to cover up night. Oh, uh, he would love it if he actually had a legion of demons. I pray to the Lord for strength in the coming days, but there is a shadow that hangs over my heart like dark wings of Lucifer himself. My favorite. It's not LaCroix, I fear. Nor his underlings, but there is fear in my heart nonetheless. An ancient evil is stirring. May God grant me the strength to overcome it. Woke up this morning, and the sun on my face was a little comfort. We lost three of the brethren last night in a fierce battle with some hellspawn minions of the vampire we know as Alistair Grout. We have been unable to find his lair, but it's only a matter of time. May God have mercy on the souls of our brethren. The mystery surrounding the Ankaran sarcophagus and the massacre on the Elizabeth Dane has my superiors troubled. I have been told to expect a package in the mail that may be helpful in shedding some light on this artifact. Its arrival seems convenient, in light of LaCroix's recent arrival. Something is amiss, yet I cannot see what machinations are at play. I will wait and have faith that the Lord will see us through. This, this is so comfy. Um, we finally found the lair of Alistair Grout, but it seems we were too late. The demon had already been sent to hell before I was able to dispatch him. I ran across a younger vampire who seemed unaware of Grout's demise. No doubt one of his sucklings came to visit his master. I took care of that demon and destroyed the house. I thank God for his eternal watchfulness over me and the Brotherhood. Uh, well, you didn't really take care of me, my dude. There seems a great unrest among the vampire brood here in the city. Perhaps the arrival of LaCroix was unwelcome to the rest of the damned? I know not, nor do I care. There will all burn, whether by my hand or the father's. The Ankaran sarcophagus was stolen today from the Museum of Natural History. The police report we obtained leads me to believe that the demon spawn were in it and that the book I received yesterday from the Vatican only reinforces that theory. I know now that these may very well be the end times and the time of the final struggle may well be upon us. I dreamed of LaCroix last night, of his hideous visage burnt to ash in the Great Inferno. May it be that this is a vision given to me by God, and that I will be the vessel of his holy vengeance. The years have been long, too long. Perhaps the soul of my father may finally rest in peace. You mean, and your father's father? And your father's father's father? Brother Kriegel reported the disturbance at the Vampire Coven we have been observing at the mansion in Hollywood. It seems that there was a party, and that something interrupted their fleshy rituals. He could say no more of the matter, but I smell a Croix meddling hand in this. All the better. May the demons feed on themselves until the world is rid of their evil. I had dreams of fires in Griffith Park last evening. I know not their origin, but I fear the worst. I received a letter from His Holiness warning me that he is fearful that the apocalypse is upon us and that my mission has become more important than ever. I hold his words close to my heart and will fight for righteousness until I am no longer able. I took Johansson from his hotel room last evening and brought him back here to the monastery. I'm convinced that LaCroix will try to find him as he is the only one with the knowledge of, about how the artifact can be opened. The brethren have warned to expect an assault on the monastery and they are ready to die for his glory as am I. May the Holy Father bless us in the last dark days and may children of Satan burn forever in the hellfires of damnation. Amen. Okay. It's a, it's a neat pack, pack, neat stack of belongings. There we go. Hey, found my words eventually. Hmm. If I remember the keys to the stupid ashes cage, it's all the way on the other side. <laughs> uh, this is gonna be a very long stroll. 
both ways. And then a third way, also in like this direction. Thankfully, no Rebeely vampires so far. I mean, vampires? That would be silly. People. No Rebeely people so far. Only sneaky, sneaky, sneaky me. Snick, snick, snick. If she walks all the way this way, I may be able to eat her. Do you need to time this right though? I think I timed it right enough. <sighs> oh, she had the key! Cool. Say that you don't really need your head, but people are looking at you right now. <laughs> yeah, so I pulled the population a little. No need for there to be so many of them. And this is definitely the more convenient ending to start the eating of them from than the other possible end. Always eat from the head down, guys, never from the ass up. You see, this place is just very patrolly. I don't like it. Because of it. Can I take away one more without anyone seeing? Oh god, wrong one. Wrong button! Hey, that guy's inedible, so it's fine that I pressed the wrong button. I have nearly reduced this place to no guys at all. So now there's one there, and there's two that are talking to each other, and that's it. That's the extent of guys in here. you thanks you'll never see me again i'm gonna go somewhere no one will ever see this face again good luck in canada canada is just where vampires go to disappear have the 
decided that that's not even a joke, that now it's canon. You go to Canada to never be seen again. No, probably works if it's werewolf territory. You see, there's one dude right over there. And he's like, free food. Well, she's a chick, but it still works. <sighs> and off the pier she went. Never to be seen again. I do have a pretty good sniper rifle. But I don't know if I should fist the boss guy or not. We'll see. Like, I did bring guns, so I don't have to fist them if I don't want to fist them, but. I'm actually full on shotgun shells, that's a new one. down in case there's no nope, nobody's here cool was i not full on shotgun shells what were those a different kind of shell i only have one sniper rifle that won't work out too well Mister, please don't shoot me. You missed. I knew Johansson would lure the servants of Satan, but I set this help for the Archfiend himself. Where is Lacroix? In your dreams? Give me Johansson, I'll let you live. He is under divine protection. If you want him, come take him if you can. He's as good as mine. Okay. Is that a person? How do y'all? They all they're all people. Oh, well, that's a new one. Really, this is the last place I saved? Here. Cool. Definitely time to save closer than that. Well, now I know that shooting him is a fairly bad option. <sighs> Majority of my abilities are not gonna work as well. There are quite a lot of dudes close to him. I have a feeling that maybe I should, like, remove them. That might be a good idea. So it wasn't 
full on shotgun shells, okay. Let me throw in a save in here so that we don't need to, to redo this over and over and over again. I'm very surprised if he's not like divinely blessed. Doesn't seem to be. Interesting. All right, I forgot to actually like hide and shit. Oops. Please stop doing that. You don't see me. I don't know who is seeing me, but it's not you. Now he starts doing the whole grenade throw for some reason. I have reloaded thousands of times this time around. <laughs> I mean, by this point. Or at the very least, I can eat him because stupid grenade bombs placed in here. Dumb dumb. Not entirely sure what they are supposed to be doing. I mean, I suppose hitting me, but. The only thing that they actually hit are those people. I suppose he just thinks, oh, I can't see the vampire, time to bomb my staircase. Maybe I will hit. Worth a shot. I think he stopped bombing his own staircase, that's good. Nope, he's still going. Silly man. You nearly hit me, continue going. <sighs> nearly there, I promise you, dude. Okay, 
pessoa de dois carros. It does have divine protection, thankfully. Because if he didn't, that would be quite funny. Let's just chase around him like a fire demon. Where did you go? Cheater, no cheating! No hopping away from the fire demon. What did I tell you about hopping away from the fire demon? Look, I'm gonna run around. I'm gonna run out of the fire demon power, right? And we don't want that to happen. See, what did I tell you? Oh, he went here. No, he went there. Okay. Stop that! Oh shit. Okay, well that's not very nice. Right, he hit me through my... F I started wiggling on low. Need to continue wiggling. I triggered fire demon transformation again. Oh no! We're we're in here. I'm I'm gonna be streaming until I finish the game today. So quite a few missions remaining, right? Honestly, it will put it about till midday my time, but like I don't care. It's it's a nice long stream stream day thing. It's gonna be a long one. Hello. I'm ashamed at my inability to hit you. Saving mid run here was a horrible idea considering that the last time I loaded into. being unable to stop dying. Stop running away! Don't have infinite transformations, okay? I'm gonna run out of blood eventually. Hmm, <laughs> let's not let's not get hit by him. We can. He's a great shot. A really good shot. Wish I was a really good shot. Now I can take a shot again. Not multiple shots though. Uh... Chalice is doing great, so I'm going to drink it. Can I shoot or...? No, of course not. I'm going to reload. Ooh. 
This whole place has been really bad. <laughs> no, that's cheating. Abusing my game given game given yes, God given powers is not though. He got hit for zero. Shit, this man's okay. What did you put on, my dude? No! Congratulations on your move. Um, I hope that you like your new place well, and that it was because you wanted to move, and not because it wasn't necessary to move. How's the new place? Is it nice? I'm putting on my armor of god again. Just so that I can get close to him. Hit him in the face. He deserves it. I did think that I was risking a lot, but not much happened here. Oh! Is it at least a good necessity, or was it like... Ran out of money level of necessity? Just gonna wait for you to start reloading, my bro. I'm not climbing that ladder. Well, that's good. That's a happy move, then. We like those, right? Lamppost, you should have been protecting me. What are you doing? As long as you don't cook yourself, it's fine. If you suspect that you might have vampirism, then better not, right? Oh, well that's really nice! Happy time then, right? Just gonna let him do his raging shots and then I'm gonna run at him when he's reloaded. a very short reload. Oh, he sucks, dick! I wish he did. Make him a lot more entertaining then. If fire hands can't hold guns, who knew? You know what? Fine. Use my last blood pack and severely regret it later. Look at him go! Look at that 
HP. Look at that HP go. Thank God. Stay dead. Yeah, I'm thanking your God for your own death. What are you gonna do about it? Take me to jail? Um, we should probably like wait until this is... Actually, no, let's just go into chance and, and see if we can talk to him like this. It's gonna be funny. I told you everything. There's no reason for you to keep me here. Well, now Let I should keep go. you here because you just saw a person on fire. Dr. Johansson. I am an archaeologist. You can't hold me here like this. I am a hostage. I do not need protection. Bring me back to my hotel. But I once. really want to protect you. Settle down, Gramps, or I'll give you something to really be afraid of. I am an old man. I How can noticed. You me like this? Do you have a conscience? Just let me go. I have a wife and children. I want to see them again. Help me. Answer my questions and there's no reason for me to hurt you. Yeah, yeah, okay. Anything, just get me out of these caverns and away from these crazies. I think I'm starting to get pneumonia. <coughs> Tell me about the Ankaran sarcophagus. The sarcophagus? You went through all that trouble for the sarcophagus? Yeah, I'll tell you. But don't you think it would be better to get out of here before those men come back? I mean, yeah, sure, we could talk and talk on the boat, but no, my, my character is just gonna insist that we talk here. Answer questions. I guess if you can get all the way here, you deserve the answers. But can I make one request first? It After was the I weirdest thing. I saw a person on fire. Escape. Sure. All right. Where should I begin? Where can you tell me about it? Let's start with the history of the Ankaran sarcophagus. That is a long and interesting legend, lost and found throughout the ages. Tell me, are you familiar with the Assyrians? I'm gonna say no. Well, the Assyrians lived in Mesopotamia, a region between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers. Most of this territory is now modern-day Iraq, Iran, Turkey, and Syria. Lovely! Go on. They were warmongers, conquerors, a people driven to expand by their kings. Even before the Romans, they migrated their conquered people to the territories to stem revolt, but... Uh, I'm afraid I'm getting off the subject. Go on. Uh, yeah, yeah, well, the markings on the sarcophagus seem to hint that it is from... Just continue going, my lad. 1050 and 800 BC, which was a period of fierce expansion by the Assyrians. Oddly, for those years, only one king shows up on the historical record. King Ramses III? While most likely he wiped all evidence of his predecessor's existence or passed the name to his heirs, one monarch, Mesarach, the one-eyed Just king, took out, like, one eye from all of his children, just in case they inherit the name, you know? But he would have had to have been over 250 years old. Like, uh... People like just had a different person. skincare routine back then. So? I find it hard to believe a sarcophagus with a person as important as Maserach could remain in, oh, what is the word, pristine or intact condition for so many years. But this is who is believed to be... That's the just the best stew. Are you sure? Men educated, guess. Maybe you have not heard. It was stolen from the museum before we had a chance to open it. Usually, we use equipment to carbon date, x-ray, and take air samples before we pry open the lid. This time, we just tried a sledgehammer. You compared him to a vampire. Any reason? You know, it is interesting that you ask me that. The goddess on the outside of the sarcophagus was Lamastu. Best In stew. Assyrian myth, Lamastu was an evil demoness who preyed on humans. My favorite Many type of stew. Her as the mother of vampire myth. And? And? 
The engravings on and found around the sarcophagus portray a regal figure drinking the blood of his enemies. It's just found them tasty, now, man. This image is found in many Don't cultures, be mean. specifically among those of royal lineage. We all can but have there our kinks. Is a quite scientific explanation. Which is? A disorder known as porphyria. In short, it is caused by a deficiency of the iron in the blood, and in many cultures... Isn't that the one where you pee purple and get insane? ...with the cure, the treatment was to drink human blood. I think I might have that. It is quite treatable today without having to drink the blood. Are you saying Meserac drank human blood? Perhaps. Drinking the blood of your enemies is, if nothing else, symbolic. Mm, it can inspire the animation. fear in your foes and dissidents. Don't misunderstand me. Good I no calories. Um, um, a vampire. Vampires. That's what caused this whole mess. These maniacs believe they exist. How do I open the sarcophagus? Ah, quite interesting. There is a surprisingly complex mechanical lock on the face of the sarcophagus. So, look, we I just filled the we lock with foam, right? And we take sarcophagus. a copy. Why no one ever found it and robbed it? It's perplexing. Okay, do you have it? How strange, you would ask. I haven't seen the key since it was loaded onto the Elizabeth Day. Well, in Turkey, you definitely patted it. It was stolen before the sarcophagus. No, I I am still hopeful that the police find both pieces before the contents can be disturbed. Do you have a copy of the key? No, it's not the kind of key you can copy at the hardware store. I can store. make it into the kind of it's key you can copy at the hardware store. And I meant you to can copy any key at the, the hardware museum. store. I've answered all your questions. Do you think now you could please get me out of here? I don't care who you are or why you've had so many questions about the sarcophagus. I just want to leave this place. Sure. Just go. Thank you, my friend. Oh, no. I, I have all four humanity. I'll need to drop that. I don't know where you came from, but I will never forget this kindness. I'm getting too human. Judgment is here. He hung, he hung on, just to say that phrase. Can't imagine how uncomfy, uncomfortable that must have been. And Dr. Man is here! Well, as long as your key is not made out of cryptids. Imagine having a cryptid key. Or an encrypted key. All of those words are good. Crypto key just makes me think of all the cryptocurrencies. So if anyone makes like an actual like cryptocurrency key on their lockbox and future archaeologists are gonna find it, I'm gonna cringe from my grave. <laughs> I hope nobody minds. I would like to eat somebody, please. Can we do that? It would be very nice. Okay, the policeman is coming from over there. He's gonna forget that he's walking in this direction a little bit. He's gonna turn around and go home, and then we can actually go and see LaCroix. Yep, he forgot. Let's not eat any poisoned people. Do you 
rewind? <laughs> you don't need two for crypto mining, you just need a whole bunch of graphics cards. And to ruin <laughs> the market for everyone else, right? He saw the future and he became a crypto bro. Don't mind him. With whom do they think they're dealing? Attack me in my own building! They're desperate. <laughs> They've shown their weakness. A last ditch attempt to steal the prize. Who did this? The Sabat. A pack of shovelheads with cheap pistols was all they could muster. Two got a few stories up, but I took care of them. And my sheriff brought the rest their final death in the lobby. Sabat animals. Look, if your army mostly consists out of expendable people, you're not gonna give them expensive weapons. The Sabat attacked why? Why else? The motive of every kindred in the entire city these last few nights. The Ankaran sarcophagus. They've been misled into thinking the sarcophagus holds a sleeping ancient. Their most coveted feasts. Diablerists. Honey, why do you have the sarcophagus if you don't think that yourself? Do you drink blood of other vampires? The Sabbat's infamy is in no small part due to their practice of diablery. That is, drinking the blood of other kindred. Especially older ones. Until they are dead. Not alive, then. Diablerists gain the power of those they've fed upon. And the Camarilla. This is an act punishable by death. For the moment, we've manipulated the press into reporting tonight's events as a terrorist attack. Their soldiers may be no danger to me, but their threat to the masquerade is abundant. As my best agent, I'm sure you can guess my course of action. I'll compliment your tie and sit down. Oh, kill the Sabbat? Oh, yeah. The Sabbat have made their haven at the Hallibrook Hotel. Apparently, I right really like murder, I forgot. Downtown. Kill their leader. The rest will scamper out of the city. This is the last time they ever sit <laughs> They're like, there's a whole batch of C4 just lying inside that chest the over there. Did you find out how my sarcophagus is opened? Yeah. What? What did you find out? Uh, the missing crate from the Dane has the key. A key? Where? Do you have it? No, but I did kill Buck. <laughs> Not only did you infiltrate the Society of Leopold, but you managed to kill their greatest hunter. You certainly are developing a legend for yourself. Superb. A toast to you. And to victory over the Sabbat. And to Bach. May all his progeny meet such... So you mean not only did the dude reproduce, but you haven't killed his children yet? That's impressive. Do you think my favorite's worth something? Here. <laughs> Pity you don't have his head. I would have sent it to the Inquisitor General. Yep, the Sabbat next. The Sabbat must be wiped out before dawn. Then I mean, maybe back, he's not breathing. The hunt for the key. Like, you can't smell anything unless you actively choose to inhale. Maybe his chest expands through osmosis, and then he expels the air while speaking, and then his chest expands through osmosis again. He never uh, even, like, uses his notes. You can always once. count on the Sabbat to do the wrong thing for the right reasons. They're reckless, but they don't normally try to attract this much attention. This carelessness warrants observation. I hope it doesn't become pandemic. Hmm. Hmm. It's the wrong thing for the right reasons? The Sabbat's goal is to stop Gehenna, which is very similar to my own, though they choose to do so through more I think violent, Jack thinks that there's... flamboyant methods. The Camarilla, on the other hand, suspends belief entirely. Or so goes the party line. Beckett, are you Sabat? What I am is kindred. How others choose to categorize I themselves... I am human, just like you and me. Only ...where local customs are concerned. Wait, what? Individualism is a path fraught with obstacles and sometimes angry mobs. But for all its hardships, 
It is the only one worth taking. I met with Johansson. What did Johansson have to say? Something about key and... Oh, stop, I'm old. <laughs> the lock and key. An invention as ancient as greed. I should have guessed. All we have to do is find a victor in this nonsense. They'll be the one with the key. He said it's a tomb of Masarak, an Assyrian king. Assyrian origin. Glad to see I'm not losing my touch. As for Meserach, I'll have to research that name. See what I can find. Hey, back yet want a smartphone? Make researching really much easier, wouldn't it? He said the reliefs on the side were of a demoness named Lamastu. Lamastu? She was a Lilith figure. They represent empowered women and the threat of such women to male-dominated society. Strange she would be engraved on a king's tomb. Maybe the king was really into cross-dressing. It's everything I know. Does that mean anything to you? It seems to corroborate my own evidence. I'm going to have to study it a little more. Maybe dig up some information on Meserach and the Lamas II myth. I'm certain the key will show up in time. Your information is appreciated. You're welcome. Questions. Excellent. Why would Sabat attack so openly? It's simple. Someone's misled them into believing there's an antidote <gasps> in this very room. They, and I suspect most kindred in Go this girl. city, would love to sink their stakes or teeth into its imagined occupant. If indeed rocketing it to the moon was out of the question. I'm supposed to wipe them out because of the attack. Well, perhaps for this pack... It's for the best. I don't think it's just one pack. Well, I should go. You don't have anything else to tell me, so, like, maybe I should, like, fuck off a little bit. Fucking off! Woo! Ooh, and I have a nice butt. Firm and round. Right, so I'm gonna do the retarded thing. Because I don't want to spend money. <laughs> And this retarded thing is I'm gonna enter the Sabbat place without buying any blood bets. I'm trying to figure out a try I don't remember which way the hotel was, so it's gonna either be this way or that way. Like there's only two ways, so let me just thoroughly check this place. Not here. There are, like, some people to eat in this way, though. Not entirely sure if I want to finish somebody off. You know what? If we graduate with four humanity, that's not the worst, right? I just have to make sure to... This will be... This is such an arc. Right? Why is there a TV here? Game, are you starting that thing where you're replacing random things with random things? Because if yes, I'm not gonna reload you for a little bit just to see how much I can break you. Oh, yes, this is what I've been looking for, except that for some reason I'm not using the front door. Probably because I might not want to get killed, I don't know. <laughs> is the world breaking or did someone divorce in front of that building? You know, it's a 50-50. Anything can happen. Okay. That's locked. We are inside the building. Thank God. I 
Excuse me, lads. Places to be. People to see. Nice little lads. Murder. Shit. That did not work out very well. How am I supposed to murder nice, some nice lads if the nice lads are murdering me? That's not very fair. Right, so just like, let's lose our mind and shit. Hi. Okay, so definitely not the most efficient way of doing things. I'm just gonna systematically eradicate this place. <sighs> Using invisibility and um, fire claws. I do have an idea. If I am gonna be using a lot of fire claws, um, Let's just, let's have an armed seven, why not? And we only have an, an armed seven when we're using this, but... Seven works, but that's such a shit approach angle. Um, I don't think I can do anything about that. You're not a holy creature, though. For that face, you're definitely not a holy creature. <laughs> Several of them just died. Um, let me just blood heal myself for as much as I can. I love being careful, which doesn't work very well if you actually want to lose humanity. <laughs> Let's leave losing humanity for accidents, eh? 
My eyes are all big. I'm like, Daddy, help me. But Daddy, no wanna. Daddy said, No help for you. Let's not get stuck on the furniture. You are inedible. Thank you. I have two pairs. They're slightly different. I have a bigger pair, but for streaming, I actually like smaller pair. But if I go outside with a smaller pair, my, my brain goes, What? I am seeing rims of glasses. This is so wrong. And then my head gets all dizzy. <laughs> I don't know why I always stream with glasses on. I mean, I should. It's healthy for my eyes, but... Um... My dude has plot armor. Plot armor being the floor right in front of him. to go to. I don't like this. <laughs> the guy from behind was like, Bulk. My character was like, dead. This is the right way to go, and I don't actually need to bother with all of those annoying people. Just like drop down here and forget that you exist, asshole. Come here. Come towards the giant ball of fire. Thank you. Next time, please step up. It, it makes my job like twice as easy. I'm not eating the floor, you guys. You can attack from there, I can't attack from here. That's. Fireball armor. Oh, are you playing the regular game again? So, getting some healing again? Let me just fuck you in a corner over here. Let's have a quickie. How about that? Right? And then I'm gonna. Then I'm gonna go for your buddy. And we're just gonna have a very interesting time in the corner, right? Right, buddy? Aren't we having fun? Okay, if all you have is a knife, I suggest not joining in. But if you wanna be a bloody moron, please be my guest. In general, I don't know about you, but when you see somebody 
being on fire. I don't go, ha, what I really want to do is knife them. But that just might be vampire preservation instincts. I don't know. Maybe, maybe if you're a sabat goo, you definitely lack those. Don't know where we're going with this whole holes in the wall thing, but sure game, let's go. Let's go with your walls and holes and digging out a pathway that's definitely going somewhere. Demolish a door, I go through it. Oh, hello there. I wonder how nicely sizzled blood tastes. Like, is it better than not very sizzled blood? <laughs> this guy wiggles a lot. I know that some people like their food lively, but me not so much. I, I prefer my food to be eaten. Please don't tell me that you're trying to cook your dog with a fireball, because that would definitely explain the behavior. Which way do I go? Uh, oh, hello, whole wall hole. Thank you. I'm just gonna assume that if you make a hole for me, that's, that's, that's the direction. If I'm going in the direction of wall holes, I am doing the right thing. Especially when I find Mr. Fisty Cups in that direction. Fisty Cups? Fisty Cups. Aww. Sorry, Doggo. Yeah, you just continue shooting yourself. Because who else would you be shooting right now? I'm, I'm just gonna continue going. Cool? Cool. Don't tell me that I'll actually have to, for the first time, use my own door, eh? Oh my god, what? I actually have to use a door? What is this? The medieval times? Time to fist some teleporting assholes. Wait till I shove my fist up your booty. Stop shoving fists up people's booties, maybe. Maybe there's better ways of doing this. <laughs> oh, right, they're not immune to assassination. Let me just try it. I completely forgot. Flaming fists of booties, not always the solution, my friends. Sometimes you have to be an invisible man on fire. And that's a much better solution instead. I can't kill you from this angle, neither can I eat you. That's very uncomfortable. Doing that, I'm fighting YouTube fairly. It's unfair for me. See, there's even a friend that's like, Ooh, "What's going on? Why am I hearing gun noises?" Just run in them without my underwear. Do you think it's gonna work? Okay, 
Okay, a frenzied wall on fire? I'm sorry, I'm just gonna eat your body right now. We, we save while going. Because you, I can actually eat. And you are retarded. Which suits me just fine. Sorry, buddy. Need to borrow a bit of your blood. I'm sure it will grow back. Don't worry about it. Losing a little bit of blood is okay. Losing all of it is when you need to start worrying, okay? Okay. That can't be the right direction. So where is the right direction there? looks about correct. Oh, hi! Thank you for showing me the way. Being barely lost, and then you were like, "It's okay, buddy, this way." And I was like, "Oh, thanks, bro." I was like really confused, but then I died. That's not very good. Hmm. <laughs> Come on, buddy, roll me. There's a lot of people in that room. I don't like it. Not that this is the only skill that I have. I have others too, but like... I am determined to flaming piss their ass. I don't know why. And everything, but you definitely cannot see me. We agree, right? And now you can see me. Hello, Fay Boy. I don't want to lose health, I want to gain it. Which means that if we ain't traveling as a giant fireball, then we're doing something very wrong. Yo, 
Yep, some friends in this direction. Um, his buddy is just there staring for a while. I mean, if you really want to get your turn that that much, I can help you. There's enough mouth for everybody, don't worry. I can mouth you all day long. Yeah, um, running includes knowing where you're going. Um, if you're gonna run and you don't know where you're going, <laughs> you're not gonna get anywhere. It's, um, a really weird concept, I know. So how about I just, like, walk for a while? It's just, there's a lot of them and I don't really like want to engage all of them. I think it is definitely a waste of them. <laughs> It's okay if I lure a couple of them out there. <laughs> That's a couple too many. Backed out. Far enough. <laughs> this is such a dumb place. I'm 
I okay? He can't see me at this very moment. Somehow. You can if I move. That skill has recharged by this point. This will help. Hello! <laughs> this is incredibly hard. I'm a bit stuck. Good morning. Okay, can still see me. God damn, so many assholes! Really? Through concordance? That guy just running around in there. Definitely don't need to wait. He can see me enough to shoot at me. I can't see him enough to mark him, which is an issue. Well, this way he's alone at least. Has spoke too soon. They're all filtering from out there. What are you even 
him, am I? What if I just took a gun? I'm really bad with gun. I forgot. <laughs> what if I continue walking backwards? Are none of them gonna come this far? I have questions. What's the matter? Did all your friends go home? Oh no! Whatever shall you do? about all of your fire buddies. Actually, are you stupid? Please tell me that you're stupid. I mean, he was, but I hesitated. I'm so confused where I am again. Nah, you're not dumb. You were before, though. I want them here, thank you. I'll equip my fists. Really need to eat this guy. I can spare a humanity point here. Oh, it doesn't even cost humanity point. Cool. Good. Oh. Shit. Um. Hi. Bye. Oh, that was so retarded. This is just you and me now, buddy. What are you gonna do? Cry for mommy? No, you're gonna shoot me because you're an asshole. <sighs> Only I'm allowed to shoot people. Thank you for following me. Did you not get the memo? Remember guys, none of you are allowed to shoot people. Only me. 
Okay. We cool. Hmm. This is gonna be like very awkward because that guy's in the air. I don't think I can eat this one. Oh, hellos! Just like hell jellos. I don't know who that is. I never played that game. An army of evil people, but they can't see me. Now they can. guy with shotgun I have places to be it's um okay it's very important that I get there well all you needed to do was not be stupid and die but you decided to be stupid and die that's not my problem I sound really evil by this point <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, it has been hell. Please help. <laughs> uh, send mental health help for my vampire, please, because by this point we're, um, in... Check notes. Insulting... Um... Insulting our own ghoul? <laughs> What is this? You died? What? Are you retarded? <laughs> Excuse me, I'm drinking here. Wake up, turn. <sighs> Fine. If you want, your turn can be now. Not Jesus, that's a very tough guy. Guy, come on, we're going over here. <sighs> yeah, this guy just doesn't like being eaten. What is he immune to food? does he think this is? Free food count? <laughs> yes! I'm very determined! I knew that was gonna be a very long stream. 
I finished my book. I um I posted it on Amazon. I wrote the ad posts for it. And um that becomes really nerve-wracking. So the best way to um avoid being nerve-wracked is to never look ever. Just get really busy. So I'm just I'm not going to look. Because, you know, some people get very angry that I write books. I don't know why. Oh, she really can't see me. Could have been sneakier than this, but whatever. I am gonna take a small break. Might be during the hollow brook or... <laughs> right after because the good thing about doing like a five hour stream is that you can allow yourself to have a bit of a break right actually no give me that blood point thank you well i hope that it does like i wanted to write it more for everyone but it just ended up so front heavy that i'm like technically it's gonna be most helpful to people that have never done tarot reading Ooh, I have three blood points stored. Cool. Okay. Uh just gonna kind of go for it. Run! <laughs> Run! Okay, I'm coming for that dude too. You know the bad thing about Concordance is that I have no idea how much HP it's on. So I can't be like, oh, I'm about to stop, start taking damage, I should refresh it. But I want to refresh it as little as possible as well because it costs like two blood points and I'm on a diet? Can I just like eat you? I hope that I can like eat you. Oh, you one of the ones that really don't like being eaten. Get it. Okay, we can do it like this. I don't mind. This works. <sighs> idiot. You died! What an idiot! If you were smarter, you just wouldn't die, bro. The blood dolls are probably like for them, but I'm just gonna interpret as them just like leaving me small gifts. Like, oh, you got this spark! How nice! How we can. I am eating my way forward, you like it or not? Thank you. Who needs weapons when you have hands? It is definitely much easier to hit things when they are on fire. Anyway, this seems like a great point to have like a small break. You know, refresh drinks and stuff. Be right back. I refreshed my lipstick. It actually doesn't look too bad now. Good. Uh, 
I have this problem. It makes me look up like a total dork. But, um... I end up eating my own lipstick when I'm... very focused or agitated. <laughs> so, like... If the game is hard, and like I have a lot of focus going or something, I just start go, 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 go and then I it disappears. The smell of your blood, young king. Once I just tracked very my important. tongue for like a Greater whole render session, I was very embarrassed. I could smell it even over the flood of my fallen brethren. Doesn't that make you wonder? Didn't I kill you already? Puppet. The strength of your blood is all that saved you from yourself. Wretched, weak-minded mongrel. The blood is wasted in you. Wasted! Wasted is what you're about to be. Miserable, ignorant gutter spawn. You are blind. The sarcophagus must be destroyed. Too bad, not gonna happen. I will do it myself if I must. And you, you will be purified. I will lick you clean like it my is lipstick. The blood that he is speaking through. The blood. <laughs> this is this gonna be a new threat? It all must be purified. You must be purified. I must be purified. Let's start. Purity sec. Yeah, come down. Oh, this is going great. Zula was confused for so long. I'm gonna drink my blood now. Remember to take your medicine. Especially if your medicine's all like blood shape. Especially remember to take your medicine. Fire fists versus Gazuzu. Zulu. He sounds like a great brand. What can I say? You can definitely afford to be careful. Come out, come out from the blood pool. Don't take enough damage while I'm there. Oh wait, it's just me, I'm hitting shit all of a sudden. And you got stuck, I suppose we both suck. Come out. Yay! I kicked his butt! improve my brawl just for like all well, my strength for even better flamey fists it's gonna be the flamey fists of the century i'm gonna fist ping zhao be at peace kindred you stand amongst friends now. i am a beautiful bonfire <laughs> you can hear me burning in the distance I am really sizzling. Is that so? Your foes all lie vanquished, kindred. I come to help. Be at peace. Trouble is nothing but yours to give. You're afraid about that, and you're the one I'm planning to give it to. I see. Well, I will waste no more of my time with you. I just thought you should know that the alliance between your prince and the Kuei Jin has come to an end. Cool! So there was an alliance. We did have an arrangement, LaCroix and I. A mutually beneficial pact to drive the lesser factions from the city. Steam crackle pop! LaCroix's zeal in recovering the Ankaran sarcophagus has been to the exclusion of many relationships, mine included. It's like I don't and like I you like anymore. You're too obsessed with the dead guy in the in box. Desperate quest for power. Look, bros before hoes, even if bros are dead. 
unlikely story. LaCroix feared Alistair Grout, the Malkavian uh, primogen. Why is this so the warm? Insight of his Probably because it's and winter and I'm cold. Close to the truth about LaCroix's ambitions. And so? LaCroix saw an opportunity to rid himself of two problems. I never listened a to her. Leader and a I don't know. Primogen, what is it? I just find her strong. talking to be boring. And as you can see, I was Irritating. Ah, things are making sense now. LaCroix convinced me that an alliance with a Camarilla could strengthen the position of the Kuei Jin. I love and your so beautiful Nine's head, voice impression. Framed Nine's Rodriguez for the murder of Alistair Grant. Did you come in there with like a recording of Nine's? That's why you only answered with the wrong thing. Uh, so you are the one I saw at Grout's mansion. Yes, you were made to be the witness. For your political naivete put your word beyond reproach. No one would believe you devise such a story. LaCroix used you and once again turned a problem to his advantage. This is bullshit. Why are you really here, Ming Zhao? Hear these words, kindred. The sarcophagus is sealed against the ages. Only the proper key will break this seal. That key now lies safely in Quajin hands. Your prince's prize cannot be had without it. Whatever. This is probably just not a Quajin lie. I assure you that it is not. LaCroix is no longer of any use to us, and by extension, neither are you. The vine of your destiny withers. Your bloodline ends with that of your puppet prince. We'll see who's the last one standing. The it's me, me, Mario! Oh wait, it was an actual... okay. It wasn't me that was crackling. Good! Just sitting here crackling non-stop would have been kinda unnerving. Anyway, I do like Concordance. I'm just like near the end of the game now and I'm just leveling my ability to punch. I hate how many people are here. It's very inconvenient right now. I need to eat somebody. <sighs> Not that guy. Not for that long, anyway. I have a really good way of proceeding right now. Trigger a criminal violation. And not a masquerade violation. And then eat the hoy. What are they gonna do? Run away? Okay, my obfuscate this book, but I don't like that. Too many calories. Look at that tasty pile over there. Sometimes even role playing a chair. He's like, I got stuck in the pile of humans. What should I do? I know, I'm just gonna sit down. Actually, as long as there is a pile of humans over there, I can probably eat her semi safely. Yeah, that worked. <sighs> Okay, off to LaCroix we go!
Hey there. Hi. You know what Hello. The other night? I couldn't come into work on account I bought a tamale from a street vendor and got the scoot something terrible. What a lucky thing too, because that food poisoning saved my he life. He has a guardian angel. I mean, he's guarding dangerous vampire people, and he's doing just fine. That's one lucky bout of the runs. <laughs> You're telling me. But if I had been there, those punks wouldn't have gotten past the front desk. There's two things I can't tolerate, and that's terrorists and tainted tomorrow. Uh -huh. <laughs> I hear that, but I do need to see LaCroix. I guess you can go on up. He wasn't expecting you, but it should be alright. Thanks? He thought I wasn't gonna make it back! Oh, that asshole! Hi! The Sabbat. Done! Another obstacle is removed. From the enemy, we resurrect a new order. And this, in no small part... It's like my strongest sense. soldier is in dying hell. Did you hear that? You were never able to wipe them out completely. Keep it up, and you may oh, have maybe his job. wanted to actually my have a job. Crusader. My victories in this city are in no small part due to you. You've done what I've asked without question, and you've done it well. Take this small token of my appreciation. We'll rule this city side by side. Continue now. getting that money rolling, honey. I'll need it for the blood to kill you. Uh, I know where the key to the sarcophagus is. This? You found the key. Where? Who has it? Ming Zhao has it. This nonsense again. Look, I told you before. No kindred would ever ally themselves with those demons. This is a subterfuge. A trick to start a civil war. And apparently, it's worked. The Nines is innocent. She took his shape. She killed Grau. As of this moment, there is no blood hunt against Nines Rodriguez. The Quajin have revealed their plot. <laughs> they want us to war against each other? Well, to that I propose an alliance with the Anarchs. Together, we kindred shall drive out these foreigners once and for all. Anarchs will never enter an alliance with you. The Camarilla are no threat to their lives, barely even to their way of life. The Kuei Jin would eradicate us all. I'll destroy us all! The members to do so, which is why a civil war would be convenient for them. I suppose you want me to talk to them? Is that it? Go to the last round immediately. Tell them the Kuei Jin have admitted to killing Grout, and that the blood hunt against Nines Rodriguez is officially over. Tell them I have realized the true threat the Kuei Jin pose and wish to negotiate a pact. You will be my emissary for the Alliance, so naturally you speak on behalf Should of the Should we Camarilla. just call her Miss Tentacles? Choose your words carefully. I don't even want to call her Miss Tentacles because Tentacles are sexy and she's slimy. Good luck. The prosperity of all this city's kindred depends on your success tonight. No pressure. I want to just assume that he's like shitting his pants over there. Like, shit, 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 shit she's still alive. What do I do? I know. A big security man goes at the forest on fire. This is like the last time that we can walk freely. So let's just see if we have any more money that we can take. Um. I have $1,134. It's an okay amount of money, but I can do with a lot more. No blood stored. That's not great. Money, right? Been a while. Your money's been piling up. Here, that should provide for an interesting evening. Thank you! I can only pick 200 offer at a time. But 300 is better than nothing.
<laughs> oh shit! Uh, please, please leave me alone. I did not mean to do that. I'm not a zombie, I swear! Why would you send Chunk when Fat Larry is the, just down the street? <laughs> it's been an accident purpose, I swear! That guy got upset I walked past. It's gone bad, I'm so sorry. It will end soon, I promise. Don't mind me. Mr. Cool First Vampire Guy. I'm just gonna get comfy over here. I have a very powerful blood. Like, it looks proper sculpted. Where to? Uh... Oh, right! I forgot! Sorry! Mm, I forgot that I still need to figure out where Nines is. <laughs> I'm sorry, the game is... I'm, I'm seeing the future. It just happens sometimes. Sometimes I'm like, am I going in the right direction? The answer is yes! I am. Thank you. For your wall donation. And everybody starts running like they've never seen a human being before. What, am I on fire? Don't think that I am. Few creatures of the night Unless you mean figuratively. Like vampires. Excuse me! You measly fuck, you got- Easy Skelter. You figured not. Said he killed a goddamn primogen. I just saw him there, at least I think I did. I'm willing to believe you were a patsy in all this, but I'll be watching you right here. Where did Nines go? Don't expect to see him until this bullshit is resolved. Or is it a fascination? You are so lucky this is Elysium, Cammy. I need to talk to Nines. The prince wants an alliance with the Anarchs. LaCroix, an alliance with us? Huh. Has he... The... You're fucking with me, right? Do I look like a goddamn source of amusement for you? Yes. The Blunt Hunt is off. We Blunt Hunt? Nines didn't do it. That son of a... And that Quajian bitch! If I ever get my hands on her, I'll tie her eyelashes to her ass hairs and bowl her ass into a car compactor! Demon! Oh, whore! Now you see why I need to talk to Nines. Where is he? Okay, alright. I'm fine, Nines. Yeah. I can't believe it's coming to this. Oh, I hate those goddamn devils even more than I hate that fascist dandy prince! Goddamn Joe. Nine times ten to watch this place. I'd be over there okay. right now making skank sushi. I get it. Where's Nines? I need to see him tonight. Nines is. Uh, Big oh, I still don't know if I should be telling anyone that Nines is hiding out in Griffith Park. Nines agrees to the alliance. Oh, I guess that means me and the cam will be on the same side. I think I'll go eat something like a vomit. Thank you. I have a good vomit. I heard that some people enjoy it. I can't believe that I'm so dense that I can't see that it's a setup all the way from Well, the prince was not expecting you to ever return. Hmm. 
Look, God gave me some flaming fists. They didn't give me all the brain cells. Ever since I died, my brain shrunk. <laughs> Please be nice. The fun place for fun people like me because we have fun in there. I mean, I'm worse, I can't see through him. You see what he did in the count is for the save function that comes pre-installed if you just happen to be the main character? The moment you see a like, big save button at the corner of your eye, you're like, oh cool, I got chosen. But then you load yourself into your death over and over and over again. Get emotionally traumatized. Good I think I saved at the wrong time. Heard you made quite a name for yourself. No small feat in this city. I hear LaCroix needs us all of a sudden. <laughs> well, I'll be damned. He proposes an alliance? Does he now? You know, we just ended a war with them and we lost a lot of people. Too many. Does he expect us to do all the fighting while the Camarilla throws mean looks from the sidelines? When you're so close up, Are you seem like a very toe -toe warm person. Goddamn devils. I keep on thinking that you're about to kiss me. <laughs> we have a bit of distance here. Who knows what he's planning? I still don't trust LaCroix. But then again, the Camarilla didn't wholesale slaughter us upon arrival. God damn it. I'm stuck between a rock and a son of a bitch. Oh, I'm ready to fight Koichin. I'm ready to fight everything. Have you ever fought them? Do you know what they're capable of? How they view our kind? They're demons in battle. Killed my predecessor. I've seen Skyrim's that happen though. with Skyrim for someone. Koi wanting to war it would constantly sudden, load into a fireball. Right. <laughs> we couldn't even press escape in time. But I think Alliance is for the best. Not what I mean, kid. Smell that? Smells like smoke. We gotta get out of here. But do you want? Kid, we've been followed. That fire's coming from all directions. It's man-made. We gotta get out of here. This is bad. Just a little fire. We'll be fine. It's not like we're flammable, brain. No, kid. You don't understand. The fire wasn't set to kill us. Come on. We gotta get to the tram. What are you talking about? What's the problem? I didn't hide out here because it was a nice view. Well, maybe you should. It is a nice view. In these parts. This is werewolf country. So what? The wolves are going to be out for blood for that fire. Come on, move! Can't we tell them that it wasn't us? Werewolves don't talk to us. Werewolves don't care. They kill on sight. Now let's move. <laughs> we can take them. No, no, we can't. You don't understand what these things are capable of. Guns are used to get close to suicide. The only thing. I go. Is now let's get to the tram. We can't waste any more time. All right, let's go. Well, the tram already Shit. left, but sure, Sorry. let's go. Come on, kid. We gotta get inside that building until it comes back. Bye. I actually don't know anyone that goes with the hide approach in here. Because killing the giant dog is faster than waiting for the tram. <sighs> three minutes, that's like forever, man. I don't have three minutes. No, granted, 
that I got confused with the way I'm going. Which is not great. That's the toilet. Uh, you have fun there. like extra aggressive this time around. Now he did it. Thank you. Pat myself on the back for that one. Unfortunately, I did use quite a lot of blood. And I didn't buy any blood packs because I didn't think that I'll need it. I have zero blood points stored. Perfect. Who needs, like, food, right? I got another- yeah, I can. I'm gonna have flaming fists at nine, bros. It's gonna be like proper fisting someone's butt. I'm saving my knuckles from Ming Zhao. I'm keeping them nice and warm and lubricated. I hope she doesn't mind. I think it's gonna be fun. Kid, get in the car. The sun will be up. We gotta get the hell out of here. Okay, Shaq. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Don't put sucking okay. candy in your Something mouth unless your you want to sound Give really me fun. KL5, oh my god. Asked to speak to the he shoved the blood bag into my Is inventory and reset my blood points. Thanks. Me. What Seems did you like do? You did you blood and yourself and then feed the me your? <laughs> feel like the world Wake up! Look alive! <laughs> yourself? Ready to move. What's going on? Get ready to run. Take everything you need. Line five, you're, you're never coming never back here. What happened? Lacroix put out enough. the word. He says you're in league with the Kui Jin, Ming Zhao's puppet. That you're the one who set up nines for. Her. See, he's figured it all out. And now your death is a big bullet point in his new unity campaign. There's a blood hunt on you. I'm in league with the Quadrant. He had to turn things around on you real quick since you found out about his deal with Ming Zhao. This is his plan B. Plan A was to kill you in Nines in Griffith Park. Now LaCroix And plan zero was me not coming back from the Sabbath. Like child. He entrusted you with so much. And you took full advantage, sold out to the Quajin and cost the people their hero. They're saying Nines is dead and you killed him. I'm bastard after all this time. Look, I'm here to help you. Again. But damn it, it's time. 
I'm for what? Time to make a choice. Ah, the what am I supposed days. to do? You're gonna have to stay off the street and stay on the move. Because it's open Anyone season on your ass. Vampire's gonna be busting in from well, Sacramento to join in on this one. Oh, right. joy. Go you need ahead, backing. Um, you need the protection of one of the factions. Friends are the last thing you want to be without right now. But you have to get out of here. Mm-hmm. Make it sound so easy. I got a driver who can get you where you need to go. Interesting guy. He'll like him. But this place is being watched. He's across Santa Monica by the junkyard. Get there and he'll get you out of town. Sounds good. All right, get running. Hope you make it out of Santa yeah, Monica at least. What are the chances of that happening? Me too. <laughs> Already running. Look at me and my little feet go. Oh, that's a very open sewer. Very soft. Excuse me. Thank you. Any of you can see vampires? I mean, see invisibility because I don't think you can. That felt like such a seamless slip in. I don't think that that dude's gonna let me pass. Thankfully, he is stupid. <laughs> Imagine being that guy. Like, everybody just missed that target, and you actively died. Here. Very well. <laughs> so, um, you know Jack? I only recently made the acquaintance of Mr. Jack. He intrigues me very much. There are so few like him these nights, I think. But then, I only know what I hear from others about the kindred of this city. It sounds as if there are many who seek to sway the children of Cain to their side. Many who believe they shape the destiny of the blood. You work for Prince LaCroix, don't you? No. You could run, but do you really think you could escape your reputation? I know little about you, except the rumors that you've killed the Anarch leader and betrayed your own kind. What else can I do? You have been accused. If you were to run, this reputation would travel with you until your final night. Your only recourse is to clear this charge. 
or to smite the conspirators working against your good name. I don't trust anyone anymore. This is the path of legends and pariahs. <laughs> Why are you to give me advice? I'm just a driver. I can't take you anywhere unless you tell me where to go. I don't know. It sounds as though you've already made a decision to me. I've met others like you, and they have always ultimately come to the same conclusion. And that is, there is no person or group on this planet they can pledge loyalty to. If this is the path you must take, I can take I wouldn't you to mind the pledging the, my allegiance to friggin' Maximilian Strauss because I'm. Um, I kind of need to hide in a chantry, but I don't know the right options to get there. If you must, Ming Zhao and Lacroix, when they are destroyed, the city will become chaos. With no heads, you can walk past this beast and into a legend. But you may never know peace. The lives of legends are the prey of the ambitious. I'm just a drag. It sounds as though I've met... If you must... Then, I will drop you off in Chinatown. Well... Where to? They didn't allow me to ally with Maximilian for some reason. I'm gonna see Mercurio. Where it is you turned your back on the Camarilla? I don't understand. I served these people for 30 years, they've always treated me well. I think you're making a big mistake. But I'm not gonna stop you. I ain't got no death wish. Oh, I'm not gonna spend all my money on that. Uh... I want Lamy Cookie. Where to? Blood. Need a fix? Oh, yeah. That's sad. I was never in Flanchel enough. There we go, now I have enough for another blood pack. Hooray! Where to? Well, we're finishing this alone then. Which is cool, I guess. Not ideal for a Bali, but come on, there. Protection of the Tremere Chantry would have lasted for like eight years, and then the Chantry got exploded. So, like, who cares? I'm just gonna. Walk into the sunset eight years early. That sounds good to me. Why is she here? <sighs> Hello? How you behave, demon. Oh, what are you doing here? I, Nani, watch temple. I think Hengayokai kill my master for ghost people. There is more evil inside. I'm going to kill Kuijin. Wanna help? Hi. 
My sword is still angry. Ikimashou. Let us kill ghost people together. Okay, I do have a question. How I just never noticed her? Was she always here? If I really want it, I can just fire fist everything. Cause like she sounds legit. I'm eating you. I don't care. I'm treating down a couple of things. She already helped enough. You good over there or? Invisible fire person. Not. I'll feed off him, you beat him up. Look, if it works, it works. I don't want to set myself on fire too much, but... The thing is, they made the game so much harder. But I can't throw fireballs, I can't like... Go inside people's brain. Oh. That sounds cool. You didn't leave your head. Well, I'm not very persuasive. about right I started and was like what no no XP how am I supposed to do this but by now I have a fully leveled Bali and the um, flaming fist is my ultimate weapon I just I fist everybody <laughs> I want to see can I fist Ming Zhao Main character enjoys it. The fisting is always good. Stick around in that way. Now my game's not responding. <laughs> Hello? Are we back yet? We are back. Okay. Time to go again.
I don't actually know what my thrusty sidekick is doing, but I hope that in some way it involves thrusting. Everything's like locked, bro. Not cool. Haha. <laughs> But yeah, excuse me. Uh. First, I want to eat the dude. No stubby stubby for me. Open all the doors like a pro. Also, hello, Vin. <laughs> I, I, for some reason, did not register that you're here. You sleep at very random times and stream at very random times and so do I. <laughs> High five. Hi. <laughs> Ooh. I see. Guys, but doesn't want to have it. It's like ah! Excuse me. You need to learn how to say please and thank you. The flaming fireball. I'm gonna be nice to you. I'm just gonna eat you. And now I'm invisible. But also on fire. I'm hearing a lot of growling, I don't like it. Ooh. Is the growling me? Do I have a zombie somewhere? Pleasure's just ah! the outcome of all of this. Well, you didn't let me eat, so now you're my food instead. Was it worth it? Was it worth for you? What is this? Food sanctuary. What are we doing, my dudes? Why is there somebody growling somewhere? They sound like an angry vampire, but pretty sure there's zero angry vampires in here. Outside of me. Where am I even going? Wrong way! 
This looks confusing. Too many doors and shit. What am I supposed to do? Open them all? Ming Zhao, get better at building temples. Look at all the swords. I don't even have proper money to out here their dudes. Like, pros. Look, if you really wanted to eat, get eaten, you only needed to ask. It's okay, I don't discriminate. <sighs> Everyone can be food. Except for the be dead people, the game's like, now nah, you cannot commit diablerie for some reason. They look very confused. Excuse me, I'm just sneaking furniture over here. Don't mind me. I could surely squeeze through that. Apparently the game went, no. It's not a proper squeezy gap. I'll show you a proper squeezy gap. I'll squeeze whatever I want to squeeze. What am I doing? <laughs> Can I pick things up that are on the pedestals again? I think I'll be able to. Y'all will have to remind me what peg goes into what hole. Hey you! Hey you! Yeah you! You want to antagonize me, bro? Uh, you okay? I think this one actually wasn't too sure if you wanted to antagonize me or not. Like, you got confused for a little while. Like, do I... <laughs> what do I do? Do I hit that or... <laughs> Do I not want to hit that? Oh. I'm already on fire. that adding more flame to the oven will help. He stands on straight columns. So elephant equals straight. Let me guess, it's the birds that are gay. Um. How would you even define that? As a shape like? Dragon sits on weird.
Okay, so there's a straight elephant and a weird dragon. Mommy, I wanna get out. So that I can place the shapes into pegs and so that I don't forget which shit goes into which hole. That's the weird. Wagon. And that's the straight. I'm so smart. I feel so much better about myself already. Now to figure out which one in these the square corridor <laughs> which way do I go? <laughs> because sometimes I just get so confused. Ah they look agitated, which means that I'm heading in the right direction. Look at them being all cool staring at each other's butt. Yeah see? The crane is the one that's twisted. That's correct. The birds that are not whoa straight. Shit. Um did I save? At all. I see. No! Let's not try and save while dead. That's not. <laughs> That's not a productive thought process. Everything is solved through fisting. Sometimes you gotta be very sneaky. And <laughs> bite them instead. But let's take the gay birds. Coming with me. Let's save. Our approach is so obvious because, like, you can see the trap shooting off. There's no way that they don't know. Shit, that was the wrong one. I wanted to heal myself, goddammit. Is anyone still like present? Excuse me. Any like temple people around? I don't think so. Oh well. It's a go time. I heard something somewhere. I think that's just me growling. Yeah, I'm just an angry boy. I'm gonna smack her with everything we got. Then we're gonna eat all the blood that we have and smack her with everything we got again. Fire! Cool. You've become a grave disappointment, Kindred. This was not meant to be a destination in a chicken path. Whoa! <laughs> Did you okay? <coughs> Excuse me, Ming Zhao, you're turning into a robot. Shut up and hand over the key. I will not let you or anyone have the power of the sarcophagus. I'm not asking. You will have time to ponder this for the for as you are devoured by worms and disease in the hell of burrowing maggots. A thousand years shall you suffer. 
Uh, whatever. <laughs> Are we okay? How many times can she divide? Because I forget. my frame rate right now. I think I never tortured the game so hard before. It was like, no! Giant ball of flames, the memory! Where to? I'll just say it's time to finish this. We are here. Um, how do you know so much, by the way? I drive people to their destination. That is who I am. What, a car? Remember, wherever we go, it is the blood of Cain which makes our fate. Farewell, vampire. Um... Right, uh, bye! We're like... The most luckiest vampire to ever live because we're like literally just talked with Kane and <laughs> here we are going to hurt her! <laughs> Whatever, bruh! Don't need you. Uh, see, I don't know what happened, but... LaCroix says I'm not supposed to let you up under any circumstances. Yep. He uh, says I technically, or the, the Volcavian. So I'm afraid you're gonna have um, to leave. Third generation vampire, I forget what they're called. Look, my brain's mushed by this point. Um, <laughs> it's either the Volcavian third generation vampire that thinks that they're Cain or Cain themselves. Um. I think that people that went through the, like, the files, um, I think it's even called Kane. What if I were to say no? Ah, come on now, just leave, okay? I don't want to have to use force, but I am authorized to do so. Please don't make me do this, Missy. What? Hey, hold on. 
Sorry, my dude. <sighs> Can I just summon the elevator from here? No. Okay. Uh, it did fill me up. Oh, antediluvians! I forgot. Ah, uh, that is a very useful way of remembering it. What if I just press the button? Did you hear that cookie? A whole ass cookie. <laughs> if you don't miss, you get dead. Go home. Tell everybody that you saw a flaming vampire. They will definitely believe you. Don't worry about anything. No way is this not stupid. I do roar one in this form. That explains it. Excuse me, sir, you look like food. I can't explain it. That will make it so much faster. La Tassa C. Their big eyeball. Well, that definitely is a door. Glad that we stared at it. Uh. I suppose the real answer was no all along. <laughs> I'm prepared to fight and run all at the same time. That looked like a door. I mean, probably because it was, but... Like, it looked like an important door and then proved to be a shitty door. Who arranged the cubicles in this way? Why was I able to go into a dead end? Was it you? I'm gonna blame you. You're just refreshing all of my abilities permanently. Thank you! So much, my guy! Still have one one big person to fist. Okay, I came from here. You know, 
Look at you, my dude! <laughs> Be fresh is for all! I mean, when you just see an invisible fireball in front of your face, maybe your brain just wants to deny its existence. Okay, well, I killed everybody and I walked a full circle, but I missed the door. Here it is. Thanks, door. It's lovely meeting you. My own flames are interrupting my ability to see. And I can't lock big doors because I am stupid. Do you by any chance like have a... <laughs> Accidentally turned on presents, so... Guys, we're half we'll have to wait out the special effects. <laughs> or we need to figure out another door. It's okay, I found it. I found another door. I see the happy ladder! <laughs> I really don't think that the game likes- Whoa! Me having all these effects activated! Look at me, boing, <laughs> boing, being the most beautiful fire cupcake. No, I'll just reload. Don't crash. I know that it's beautiful what is happening, but please don't crash. Thank you. Mushroom boing is complicated. <laughs> Come on. Come on, legs, we can do it. <sighs> We're nearly at the ceiling. Uh, I stood, stood up, sit down, stood up. <laughs> okay, don't, don't do that. <laughs> okay, they're still ignorant. To me existing, that's good. Come on, pipe. We can do it, pipe. We did it, pipe. <laughs> I'm bringing so much blood, and my fists are on fire. Can I do one more? 
Yes, I can have the ultimate fist. <laughs> the ultimate flaming fist. <laughs> I can fist everybody. Oh, this is so much fun. Does that... Is that door any better? No. Only the locked doors are good doors. But I mean, this guy is kind of stupid. Because look at him. It was... Don't ever keep your back to mystery doors that open on their own. Really? Oh, I'll need to waste blood! But what if it's Chris's blood? That make it better for wasting or worse? Are you wearing a helmet? Can I eat you? I can't eat you. Cool. I really love it when my guys come pre-equipped with no helmet. I didn't LaCroix gave the SWAT team a helmet. I mean, he knew that they were dealing with vampires. Me really think that I wasn't gonna be like, ooh, free snack! This one has a helmet, I can't eat that. Wait a minute! I think I just walked around, I'm a blow myself up guy. And some whole floor too high right now. Hey, when that happens. I can even... The button for going further up though. I can't do it unless I trigger that stupid conversation. I anticipated you'd make it this far. <laughs> I had no doubt. Apparently you did not. But I am not so easily betrayed. Did you ever think about what it takes to live as long as I have? To come this far? Yeah, it takes Consider climbing like high objects and never getting in your down. Last few seconds. Consider this, you're gonna die tonight. Tick, tick, tick. Abiento I love your nostrils. Kick. Help! I don't really want to help you. Help yourself. here for the boom. Will that help? Maybe. We'll see. Does the boom take out the other floor? That's the right question. I'm gonna see no. No! I was correct. Proper confused. How are you 
guy is still alive. Are you like stupid? I got stuck inside the elevator. And now the elevator is stuck. Are you okay, elevator? Uh, I think the whole game isn't okay right now. I anticipated you'd make it the tick. Help. Hey. <laughs> Possibly. Oh well, it worked. It was me! Coming through! I mean, by this point, the game is literally getting tortured and it's not even in the cherry orchard. I don't think that he's a happy man. I mean, we fought Ming Jia at 4 FPS. This is danger territory. Go Kaboom. Thank you. Can I lockpick this? That's the question. him to be infinite food. Don't know who Garrett and Evan are, but I'm not very interested. Guys, are you Garrett and Evan? I mean, maybe. You might be Garrett and Evan. <laughs> you guys 
these are even important enough to have names. I'm impressed. You know who's not important enough to have a name? That guy. I can't believe that I can actually eat you. Thought your helmet protected you against random vampire attacks. I don't know why. But anyways, thank you for your fast delivery. I thought I might need to pop a blood pack and now I don't. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is such a good time. Okay, time to fist the fistiest of them all. You, my boy. Okay, it's time for him to go now. I'll use this. Why not? Look, if you can carry a big sword, wouldn't you want to? I wonder if it's just made out of, like, concrete. me but if you are gonna shoot me then I will use you as a blood bag. The rules of combat state that I can. Come back here! again where are you even going Going, at least he's having a good time. I'm not. Like, it's very important that you get to be very slow. Good job over there, soldier. Continue doing what you're doing. Your butthole. I appreciate this dude constantly respawning. Sometimes your food needs tenderizing. It's okay, it happens. I think 
them down a light though, which is fine. Yep, this light is dead. build worked so well. Let me just drink some blood in front of LaCroix as just a way to show up. Haha. <laughs> I have the best fisticuffs. Sire like child. I should have killed you that Why? Night. Was my sire trying so to fist you? Did you injure me? Huh. You think you've taken everything away. But I still have my sarcophagus. But you need this to open it. <laughs> You've done all the work for me once again. So much to learn. I thought I had lost it all, but no. Here you've sailed on a Gehenna wind, bearing my salvation. The key to my future. Shut your goddamn mouth, you long-winded Euro-trash prick. It's go time. <laughs> Give me the key. I won't. I said, Give me the key. When you're trying to use your abilities, do you need to spell out the command the slowly, LaCroix, always? Sit down. Your blood, it's falling out. Yeah. It can't end like this. You must have like Don't a constitution of one because all. he's not healing that. I, I can't lose. I will open the sarcophagus. I'll build an empire. It won't end here. Look, here's your key, and I'm gonna leave now. <laughs> <laughs> Only because they know what's in it. I'm just like, I just wanna go home. And then he triggers the kaboom and I'm like, wait what? I've got the key. In a few seconds, I'll be powerful enough to crush you like paper. This whole city! I'm crushing this whole city like paper! All the buildings gonna get it. <laughs> and then every single person that you're trying to dominate just goes. What? In a few seconds, it will be all mine. The key, give me. Power. You should. <laughs> Oh, the smiley face! See, he's smiling too! Isn't it fun? My feet don't work very well on the surface of Damn. the pavement. Kid, I knew your reputation, but hell, I don't think any of us could I... control like that. Kid, where are you going? Hey! Hear me out. We could use someone like I you. I don't think you... Kid? Dude, I'm a Bali. I don't think you may want... You definitely want to reconsider that. Now ain't that a beautiful thing. Hey, Messerat, buddy, I'm talking to you. <laughs> you don't really talk much, do you? <laughs> hey, it happened just like you said. <laughs> they never even knew what hit them. Through that sarcophagus out there, and they just tore each other up trying to. Your friend them. is just shedding black. <laughs> Worked out all right, huh? Think we should be concerned about that? Remember, wherever we go, it is the blood of Cain which makes our fate. Farewell, vampire. <laughs> 
Uh, I hate when all my black falls out. I need it inside me. Oh, best ending music. Sounds like an alarm clock. Oh no, somebody died. They were all kinda old, it might be okay though. But like... Also only like 53, so maybe not. I'm gonna assume that that's like his... Aura. There we go. <laughs> When he walks, he just sheds black off himself. Like all the dirt just goes poof. It just fall off. Anyway, this has been fun. <laughs> but I've been like tired for over an hour now. Because it's been a long stream. Um, when I come back here, I think Salubri is one of the possible options, so we're gonna go for the soluble breeze. <laughs> and I come back here every week, so, you know. And then I don't know what we're gonna go for as the last one, because I tend to do three runs, and I'm very much not interested in the African tribes, because I'm like, but they're No idea who they are! It's never that invested in the continent of Africa. So, I'm gonna see. Um, thank you, Hexman! <laughs> and... Thank you all for being here for the stream, and I see you the next time. Bye, B.